Soldiers and airmen in the logistics fields are used to supporting their brothers and sisters on the front lines. However, in the nation's response to COVID-19, the new front line is held by doctors, nurses, CNAs, and other medical personnel. Whether supporting the war fight or working with state partners at home, the Maine National Guard is poised to lend a hand. Local guardsmen have supported Maine Emergency Management Agency and Maine CDC since the early days of Maine's response by conducting ongoing warehouse operations. Deliveries are carried out by Maine's Department of Transportation, other guard personnel, or in some cases, a commercial carrier. With Maine and the country fully engaged in the COVID fight, soldiers and airmen are glad to play a part. I am Staff Sergeant Ali Kareem. I am originally from Iraq and I reside in Auburn, Maine. I am with the 243rd Vehicle Maintenance in uh, South Portland. I joined the Maine National Guard because um, I came right after active duty and I wanted to continue on serving the country that has given me um, so much since I came in as a refugee in 2008. The mission that I'm working on here is to support the Maine CDC and the DOT in providing PPE for essential healthcare providers. This means that we come in in the morning, we get a pick sheet. This pick sheet has a certain amount of number of gloves, gowns, face shield. We get them all together, we verify them, we package them, we get them for the um, DOT transportation to come and get them you know, the next day or that same day. The best part about being called for state active duty is to do my part in this COVID-19 situation to help our state, you know, state of Maine, and to just, it gives me a good feeling that I am doing my part in helping and combating COVID-19. Guardsmen across the state remain prepared for further taskings that may surface during the COVID response. For the Maine National Guard, I'm Major Carl Lamb.